Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another plan with me for you for the week of August 24th through August 30th. For this week I did pull in the Honey Kit from Coffee Doodles Co. I also pulled in a bunch of glitter headers from Mandy Dreams whose shop is not currently open. And then I also pulled in some date dots as you saw before from Sweet Bella XOXO. I just really thought that the black background on these date covers, or not date covers, uh, date dots from Sweet Bella XOXO went really well with this kit and sort of helped provide some contrast from the background of the date covers, which are super cute, but they are also very patterned. So for this week, I decided to not stagger my glitter headers. I did stagger my full boxes, just not the glitter headers. I guess I was just going for a more... I don't know, uniform look? I don't know. I guess I just decided not to do that for this week. And then I accidentally put my full box in the corner a little bit too far down, so I moved that back up and then put in the August script from Rose Colored Days. Then I started putting down all of my full boxes. I think this was one of the weeks that I was trying to avoid using a whole lot of foil. I had been using a lot, a lot of foil over the past couple of Plan With Me's and I really wanted to try something, I don't, I guess I should say, like not, not really try something different, but sort of go back to basics and not use a ton of foil. I don't know, I was just feeling something different. Then I put down the two washi strips that came with the kit, at least on the first side of my planner, and then moved on to the second half of the week. I really love this full box, or the not the full box, the double box that I used over the weekend. I think it's super cute. And I'm just now realizing, looking at my planner, I didn't actually use a weekend banner for this week. So, oops, maybe oops, or maybe not oops. Maybe I did that intentionally. I don't know. I was just trying some things with this spread, and I think it worked out well. I think it turned out pretty cute. I feel like, so I've been doing <laughs> a number of voiceovers today, and I feel like I'm starting to run out of things to talk to you guys about, um, at least until I get into the plan with me and actually see what really happened this week. But I also pulled in some water trackers. Those are all from Glam Planner, and I thought this peach color went super well with this kit, and yeah, just decided to use those. Then I moved into my sidebar. I used the two habit trackers that came with the kit and layered over them some scripts from Kinsey's Creations. Then I put down a piece of washi that I was using as a like sort of faux header and used a steps script from Kinsey's Creations and then also the weekly box that came with the kit. And then I put down the extra strip of washi, which I ended up having to cut down a little bit because it's wider than a typical full box is. So I ended up trimming that down. And then I put down another piece of washi and an ombre heart checklist, which is from my leftover stash. And I'm not 100% sure where that ombre heart checklist is from. So I'm sorry about that. And then if I didn't mention that Happy Mail script is from Sweet Bella XOXO as well. So moving into the day by day, on Monday the first thing that I wanted to mark was that I really did not sleep well. And this is going to begin the saga of no sleep basically for multiple weeks on end. So um, <laughs> this was also a pretty big reason why I wasn't recording voiceovers at that time, just because anytime I tried to talk about anything, I was borderline incoherent, um, just because of sleep deprivation. So I <laughs> used a panda, em or not panda emoji, a panda munchkin from Once More With Love and a hashtag team no sleep sticker from Letters to Apollo. Then I wanted to mark work and that work sticker... Well, the script is from Mandy Dreams and the Fox and Cactus girl is, or the laptop girl is from Fox and Cactus. 
And then, as always, if there are any stickers that I have skipped over talking about or anything like that, please let me know in the comments below if you are curious where they're from. As always, all of the stickers that I use, or all of the shops that I use in this spread will have links down below in the description box where you can check them out. Let's see, Tuesday was another super tired day. Um, I was very stressed out after the emergency visit I had had the week before. So, yeah. I just basically wasn't really sleeping at that point because of that. Um, I also wanted to mention the work from home script, and that is from the sticker Oki. I believe that was a custom from a while back, but just wanted to mention that. I also brought in some Simply Gilded Washi on Tuesday just because I had a little bit of awkward extra space there, and I was going to try to avoid pulling in a lot of foil for this spread, but I feel like that washi, the little like five millimeter washi worked really well there. Let's see. There was a lot of cooking that we did on Tuesday night. The two munchkins are from Once More With Love. And then I also watched Fire Force with my husband. I believe that was one of the newer episodes that we were watching, like as it was simul dubbed. And the TV icon is from Little Miss Papery, I believe. On Wednesday, pretty much nothing happened. Um, I had coffee that morning, and I mark coffee in my planner because I'm not a super huge coffee drinker. So whenever I do drink coffee, it's kind of like a thing. Um, <laughs> anyway, then I also marked working from home using another Fox and Cactus Girl and another script from the sticker Oki. And then I pulled in this washi from Wonton in a Million, I believe. And just wanted to mark having a lazy day. I was very anxious that evening and just needed to take some time for myself because I had a doctor appointment the next morning that I was really anxious about. So that is the first thing that I marked on Thursday. And I did pull in an extender half box um, for that day just because there was a lot going on on Thursday as opposed to what happened on Wednesday. So yeah, I had an ophthalmologist appointment because I was having eye troubles, obviously. The Dr. E. Modi is from the Coffee Monsters Co. And then he prescribed a new medication that I had to take, so I had to pick that up from CVS on my way home. And I believe that prescription sticker is from Once More With Love. I think. I could be wrong, but I think it's from Once More With Love. Then afterwards, I treated myself by going to Starbucks, and that Starbucks script is from Letters to Apollo, and the emoji is from the Coffee Monsters Co. Then I worked the rest of my day from home, and then added in an extra piece of washi from Simply Gilded just to take up a little bit of extra space. So let's see what else happened. I guess I fixed the spacing there, but I also in the evening did some cooking with my husband and I used any modi from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that. And then the evening was pretty much just really a struggle evening. I was in a lot of pain just in general, like my head hurt. I, I don't know. So I just wanted to make sure that I marked that. Sorry, this is not the most positive plan with me, so I apologize. But, I mean, it is real life, right? And at least my planner looks cute, so that makes it better. Yeah, that was also just, like, feeling sad, so I used a crying munchkin from Once More With Love and a script from Mandy Dreams to mark that. On Friday morning, we had a thunderstorm. I feel like I've talked about rain a lot in the last few plan with me's. I really just, I love the rain. So I wanted to mark that. And then I was having a really good energy day that day. Um, I think in, in large part from the new medication that I had had from my doctor the previous day. So I used a spoony emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark that. And then I marked working from home the same way that I had pretty much for the rest of the week. 
And then I wanted to work on some filming. The film script is from Kinsey's Creations and the little Maru is from Paper and Milk. Then in the afternoon, I wanted to do a YouTube binge or yeah, I guess I just, I did a YouTube binge. The script is from Kinsey's Creations and the Munchkin is from Once More with Love. I also painted my nails that evening and snuggled my Maisie girl. So I used a paint nails script from Kinsey's Creations and a paint nails emoji from the Coffee Monsters Co. And then below it, I used a custom script from Kinsey's Creations to mark snuggling my Maisie girl. And that Shih Tzu sticker is from Planning Made Easy. On Saturday morning, I woke up at 4.43 a.m. <laughs> Hence the why me munchkin from Once More With Love. Then I snuggled my kitty cat and the cat sticker is from Silver Oak Design. The script is from Kinsey's Creations. I also had a hair appointment that day and marked that with an icon from Libby and Co. It's been a while since I've used my Libby and Co. stickers and really wanted to pull those back out for this day. I also wanted to mark getting gas on my way home. That car sticker and the flag both came with the kit. And then when I got home that day, um, there were a bunch of bees hanging out in my like mini garden outside. And I was able to get up really close and personal and just take photos. There were like bumblebees and think there was like a woodcutter bee there there were just a lot of bees outside and they were super cute so I wanted to take lots of photos anyway then I also did some filming and relaxing for the rest of the evening the camera and the relax uh, munchkin are both from once more with love on Sunday morning I did some more snuggling with my Maisie girl again the Shih Tzu sticker is from planning made easy and the script is from Kinsey's creations Let's see, afterwards I, or maybe during, I also did another YouTube binge. Again, the script is from Kinsey's Creations and the Munchkin is from Once More With Love. We also had Five Guys that day and that burger sticker is from Paper and Milk, I believe. And I sort of goofed up on the spacing and squished the hamburger sticker sort of in the fold of that half box extender. So I tried to fix that. I also took a nap later that day and used a Maru sleeping sticker from Paper and Milk as well, and a nap script from Kinsey's Creations. That day I also needed to do some laundry, so I used a laundry basket sticker from Fox and Cactus and a laundry day script from Whimsical Plans. And then I just wasn't feeling that great for the rest of the afternoon, so I used a tired looking emoji and just wrote that I wasn't feeling well. And then later in the evening, we went and made, well, we didn't go. Um, my husband picked up groceries so that we could make homemade pizza, so I used a pizza munchkin from Once More With Love, and then was just sort of feeling the struggle that day. So I used a hang in there uh, munchkin from Once More With Love to mark that. So here is the finished spread. I don't think I did a viv wiggle because there's really not, there's hardly any foil in this kit or in this spread and there's everything that I have left in the kit. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.